Three-year-old trotting fillies on the track for the second final heat of the 52nd Kentucky Philly Futurity, sponsored by Al Livefeld Marvin Katz. The one air begot a G, Jimmy Tactor Train, Jettick Jingron Drives for Marvin Katz and Al Livefeld. Number two is Dream Together, Luke Blaze Trains for Determination, Dan Dubay. Three, That's All Money, Jimmy Tactor Trains, Tim Dietrich up for the Brittany Farms, Marvin Katz and Al Livefeld. Four is Hot on Top Hill. Marty Fine Drains for the Hot on Thoroughbred Farm. Dave Miller. Five Ice Attraction. Ocus Fonstead Trains Drives. He co-owns with uh, Douglas Sipple. Mountain Jet at Burroughs. Little E LLC. Six Trey Viso. Charlie Doris Trains and Drives for the Clee Brothers Stable and Kirby Doris. The Seven is Cool Cates. Noel Daly Trains. Brian Sears Drives for Barbara Matthews. Number eight is Sunshine Delight. Stefan Lynn trains Brett Millerbump for James Wilhite Jr. Nine, Sietta Hanover. Ron Burke trains for the Burke Racing Stable, the Air Horse Sense Stables, JT Silva Stables, Matt Kikaley. And number 10 is Dream Baby Dream. Rod Allen trains and drives for Rod Allen Incorporated. And Joseph Palermo be a third. So that is your field here. Second final heat. But the 52nd Kentucky Philly Futurity, sponsored by Liv Veld and Katz, $168,000. The Three-year-old trotting Phillies lined up. For the second and final heat of the 52nd Kentucky Villa Futurity, full field of 10. The Ryan Gain. And they're off. Ice attraction goes spreading out from the center with Treviso next door and Dream Together will join that pair down at the inside as they work their way towards the opening turn. Charlie Doris and Treviso are up to take up the early lead. It's Ice Attraction. There's a way of tracking in a second Dream Together. The inside third, the big favorite here, Rihanna G, came out to fourth. Dream Baby Dream, had an early tuck fifth in front of that saw Muddy. Hot on top field is uh, next, with Cool Kate's bottle beginning behind the two trailers. Our Sunshine Delight and Sietta ahead of her. It's a very reasonable opening quarter, 29 and 3. The sloppy conditions, the Phillies make their way up the uh, back stretch, and Treviso still winging up top here for Charlie Doris. Got to go away to the outside. There goes Dream Together, who's rushing up for Dubay. Ice Attraction is in behind those two. A third, a Jingra still on hold. Fourth, but there we got a G. His Dream Baby Dream gets set to follow the uh, favorite from fifth. That's all, buddy. He is stacked up right now in the sixth spot. Hot on top hill was in tight quarters briefly with Cool Cates looking to shoot the gap dead at the inside. They're by the half mile marker, but 57 and 1. And that is Dream Together, the new leader on the far turn, Treviso. Is tracking in behind, but now here we got a G. Moves up on the outside for Jean Gross. The favorite here we got a G is making steady progress, and she is up to engage Dream together as they drive midway around the far turn. Treviso is hanging in from the third spot. Dream, baby Dream up on the outside with Ice Attraction pinned down in fifth. They're on three quarters in 125 and two, but here we got a G is drawn even with Dream together as they turn for home here in the uh, Kentucky Philly Futurity. And it is here we got a G who is right alongside Dream together. The these two are battling it out. Dream Baby Dream is down the center of the track. Third ice attraction looking to slide out. Deep stretch now. Here we got a G, a short lead from Dream Together who tries to counter and quicken. Ice attraction threads through. Tight finish coming here. Here we got a G, ice attraction. It's ice attraction. Ice attraction pulls off the shocker in the Philly for Journey over here we got a G and Dream Together. Dream Baby Dream there as well. 154 and 2.
Judges have posted the five ice attraction. Uh, but the final steps to take the fifth of maturity over the big favorite, Ariana G. Number two, Dream Together was third. Number 10, Dream Baby, Dream fourth. So it's 5 1 2 10 in the eighth. Muscle Hill, the uh, sire of half the field in the fifth of maturity final. A Muscle Hill sired super factor here. 5 1 2 10. Returning track side for the Diamond Creek Farm, a winner's presentation. That is the five ice attraction. 29 to one upsetter. The uh, champion of the 52nd Kentucky Field of Futurity, Ocas Vonstedt, the trader band driver. And he is the co owner of Wrightstown, New Jersey, along with Douglas Sippel, Georgetown, Delaware, Mount and Janet Burroughs, West. Or New Jersey and Little Wee LLC of New York, New York. Ice attraction after finishing a third in the first heat. And beyond Ariana G this afternoon. Comes back to thread through and get up in time here for the 29 to 1 upset. She's a three year old daughter of Muscle Hill out of the Conway Hall Mayor, the Ice Queen. It's Ice Attraction. Who wins for the fifth time of this season, the eighth time of her career. All track score 154 and 2. She was bred by Stephen Day the third of New Jersey and David Reed of New York. It's Ice Attraction who takes the 52nd Kentucky Philly Futurity. Greeting the Winning Connections track side on behalf of the sponsors, Al Livveld and Marvin Katz. The Glass family. We're happy to have them with us here. Jane Glass, Jimmy Glass, and the uh, family who were instrumental in the uh, Liveveld and Katz connection. Dating back to uh, Bart Glass, married to Jane for better than 50 years, former manager of the Kentucky Standard Bread Sales, consulted and raised their yearlings for many years. So the Glass family on hand for the trophy presentation of the Kentucky Philly Futurity. And that goes to the 29 to 1 upsetter, Ice Attraction. She returns 60, 140, 860, and 520. Second to the favorite, Ariana G, 210 and 210. A third of the two dream together, 220. The exact $171.60. The trifecta, 4 buck, $452.40. 20 cents, superfecta, $818.08. And a shocker here with the Philly Futurity as Ice Attractions brings the 29 to 1 upset. And Nick Salvi is standing by with some happy connections trackside. I was hoping for second. Jeff Corral, it's like the, the Red Mall experience this year is a, certainly a positive one. You just beat Ariana G with Ice Attraction. Yeah, I'm shocked to tell you the truth. Almost as shocked as when we sold that horse for 480000 So uh, it's been a great week for me. I've been coming here for a long time. I've never had a week like this.
Yeah, you're having a week. And I work for Jeff, and I've never seen him speechless before, so it's quite an event. She's a nice filly. She's been kind of good all year. It's nice to see her get a big one. It is. Uh, Oki's been high on this filly. She got sick, and, uh, you know, I was kind of hoping he was going to get up for second, and then all of a sudden I realized that she won. There ain't nothing like winning. So you're going to come back next fall, you think? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back next fall, God willing, that's for sure. Thanks, Jeff. Gabe, uh, forward, onward and forward. Onward and forward, Nick. And